Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to this Iberian derby, as some will call it. Derek Ray and Stuart Robson in the commentary position. For all that both Spain and Portugal carry a strong pedigree, the fact is, Stuart, Spain have had the better of things down the years. They've never lost to Portugal either in qualifying or at the World Cup itself. And I think it's going to be an interesting game in terms of tactics. Spain will dominate possession. They will keep the ball, they will try and probe, they will try and penetrate down the outside. Portugal will play on the counter-attack, win the ball back in good areas, and then counter-attack at pace. I think this has got a really good feel to it. I think Spain will win, though. Here's the lineup for Spain. Jordi Alba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Ferran Torres plays with Marco Asensio out wide. And Morata is the main striker for this match. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio begins in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Ruben Neves plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And the match begins. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Now he must favour the cross. Opportunity here. And quite simply, a wonderful chance was squandered. Gabby. And they need to get tighter here. Marco Asensio at the far post. Well, they can keep possession now. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Oh, managing to beat him. And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, a short corner here. Ronaldo. Here's Carvajal. And a poor pass it was. No getting away from it. Throw in here. Bruno Fernandes, here's Ronaldo, and that's very good refereeing to let the play flow, Bruno Fernandes, William Carvalho, oh that's textbook goalkeeping, and short it is, he got in the way of that cross,
They favoured a short one here. Fernando Silva. That is a really disappointing effort. Goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Sergio Busquets. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Morata is up there. And this situation could be dangerous. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And how about the short corner? And played to the front post. Well, still an issue here. And the referee blows for a foul. And that's not going to worry the keeper. Really closing him down. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Leal, Bruno Fernandes, and space for him to cut in. Look, look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Morata. Morata! And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. So, back underway. Having conceded, let's find out if Portugal can flick a switch and come up with a goal of their own. Bruno Fernandes. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Morata. And Torres on the ball. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Busquets trying his luck from long range. Oh, he could have added to their advantage. Well, it was a decent effort, but they're still looking for the buffer. And time for the change now. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Well, it didn't go to plan in the end. Cristiano Ronaldo. Neves. 
Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Shot attempted. Oh, he saved it well. Well, opting for the short corner. He read the cross, but now must clatter it clear. Can they hit on the break? This looks more than decent. Well, then there to tidy up. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Morata. He continues his run. Teammates in the middle. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Well, they're going for the short one. It might still be problematic. And he takes on the shot. Well, what a good stop to keep them in this. Well, that would have been game over. Not long left now, though. Substitution time it is here. They take it short. And Morata's in the vicinity. And the danger's still on. Laporte putting his body on the line. Andre Silva. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Well, a successful intervention, winning the ball back. Well, finally, it goes out of play, and the pressure was there from the start. Sergio Busquets. The whistle is sounded, and a place for Spain confirmed in the last four. Well, Derek, that was a tough game. They had to work really hard to edge it. Credit to the note, they didn't have it all their own way, but they showed a lot of character and resilience, which will hold them in good stead going forward into the next round. Well, then the final analysis, Morata did his job. How would you sum up his contribution? Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today, 